Another team with playoff football on their mind, the Sands Mustangs, who come into this season ranked number seven in the state. Matthew Vinueva traveled to Ackerley this morning to give us a closer look. There was no better storyline involving a complete turnaround last year than Sands. We had some injuries, so a couple of kids didn't play early on. and we, we had a tough schedule. We played all D1s, and uh, I kept, just kept telling them, if we can get the district, not that our district was easy, but I knew that it, it would make us tougher. And then once we got the district, we went 3-1 and one in district. So we was 4-6 and six going in. The playoffs went... Went one, two, and lost one, so we ended up six and seven. Went three rounds deep. Ten starters from last year's surprising season return, including the straw which stirs the drink on offense. Senior spread back Dayton Edelman, who last year piled up more than 6,700 combined yards and 87 touchdowns. Our offense is a lot of fun. We know we're going to score a lot of points because uh, our offense is built like that, and we got we got a lot of speed and. We got a lot of numbers and uh, we just got to worry about defense. He's right on the money about that. On average, Sands allowed two more points a game than the offense scored, something they'll need to address. It's, it's going to be tough to improve it, but we're starting right now running through drills to get better on defense. On offense, we're going to score a lot of points. We know that. But on defense, we're in championship, and that's our goal right now is to improve on defense and get better on defense. In Ackerley, Matthew Villanueva, CBS 7 Sports.